his first season on the Premiership panel in charge of a match of critical importance in the Championship stakes. The heads that stay coolest should be celebrating the Championship in a week's time. Manchester United still in pole position. Thanks against Leeds to their 100th win in the Premiership. Earned by the 50th goal of Roy Keane's career. A career, of course, split between Nottingham Forest and Manchester United. Clement. Here's Steve Stone. Sharp chasing back. Philip Neville's clearance intercepted by Scott Gemmell. Talk of change kits here, not encouraged, but Nottingham Forest happy in their yellow, in which they too conceded three goals at Southampton. But they scored four that day. <laughs> Even in this highly professional industry, don't underestimate the part played by superstition. Well, Manchester United set out exactly the front of Woodmark. But Forrest, uh, it looks like Brian Roy's just trying to tuck himself on this left side, and Ian Warren, most certainly, was tucked in more central. So they could be opting for the five across the centre and midfield. Well, they've been winning at home, Manchester United, so be it narrowly, four successive 1 0 scorelines. Giggs. A chance to give them an early start here, looking in the end to cut it back to the centre where Cantona had darted in. Sharp was arriving. Uh, just for a second, I thought he was just going to opt for goal. I think he would have liked to have taken the shot on, but he obviously felt the angle was a little bit acute. Opted to pull it back, but it was good defending. But that is certainly a, a feature of the game to look for. Keggs with his pace and his engine, making those runs through the centre. And there's Scholes and Cantona can and park the centre backs, create a bit of space, and it'll be even more inviting for the likes of Ryan Giggs and Roy Keane in particular. Put out by Phil Neville. Forrest still with their eyes on a return to Europe. Three matches to go for them, including today. They probably need to win them all. That would, of course, mean toppling the top two along the way. Stone went down, no whistle from the referee, the ball stayed in play. Beckham, stylishly for Giggs. Obviously with license to get forward from the centre of midfield. And be coming between Skulls and Cantona to give a uh, different dimension to Manchester United. It might mean Roy Keane having to hold a little bit more than his nature tells him to do. But I think Roy Keane looks back and he sees four of his defenders and only one really up top, Jason Lee for Forrest. There's nothing stopping him, I feel, if he wants to go going. It may be that Frank Carr's gambling and his team can get possession of the ball, Mark. And the extra man in that midfield area, they do like to pop the ball about, pass it about. And it may be that's what he's going to try and do, is get possession of the football. Knock it about that midfield area, make Manchester United work. But I stress, they need possession of the ball first to be able to do that. Never. Here's Sharp, who's been in and out of the team recently. Putting it in early, it was pretty straightforward for Steve Chettle. Giggs. Forward by Rowan. Lee can't hold it up, David May tight on him. Scores. <laughs> 